You guys are adorable. Yeah, Mommy, I want to read that one. Oh. So precious. We came in here, they did this on their own. Sharing the blanket and everything. Holding? Oh, oh, I get the one. I'm holding. <laughs> you can hold the other side, okay? That was a great bow. So Sophie just had ballet. And we changed clothes and now we're gonna run to the post office box. This one, yeah. Which one? There you go. Like that. Anything good? Got one letter. One magazine. Aw, no mail. We'll come back and check. We'll get mail later. Look at this, Sophie's. This is the bow they wear in ballet for name tags. Isn't that cute? I'm about to get my eyebrows waxed. Hey you guys, so now we're gonna go into Cole's all red faced from the waxing. That's okay. We need sheets. We bought that new comforter, <clears throat> but it wasn't a set. So the sheets that came with that, they paired with it in the store, were way too dark. So I'm gonna go in here and I have a coupon and maybe can find some brighter sheets. Cause it doesn't look, we have brown sheets on our bed right now and I don't like that look. So I'm gonna go try to do that real quick. But look at my eyebrows. Am I even filming my eyebrows? I'm trying to see. Do they look better? So much better. So we're doing, yesterday I spent some time doing stuff with Grayson. Now we're doing stuff with Sophie. And I literally just walked by this mirror and I was like, what? I'm so, so pregnant <laughs> and you look beautiful look at that look at that you guys that is an almost 38 week belly right there Woo! crazy all right Sophie's shopping I told her she can pick out any box. outfit she wants I'm trying to do it. and I have to Mom. I have to bite what you find I have to bite my tongue a little because I'm not into Certain things <laughs> like this. <laughs> That's really cool. Let me find. Let me try to see if it's in your size. I have nothing against licensed characters at all. Like Hello Kitty's adorable, but I just prefer it not on my kids' clothes. You know. But she's at that age where she really likes it, so it's like, what are you gonna do? I mean, I can't dictate everything. That's not cool. <laughs> so I bite my tongue a little bit. Try to rein it in. <laughs> You guys know it. You have to do it. You have to do it. <laughs> How cute is this kid, you guys? How cute is this kid eating his apple, his little boat shoes on? That is my cute kid. Mommy, Want me to hold the rest of the apple? You've eaten a lot of that apple. Are you seriously eating part of the core? Because that's gross. Yuck. You guys, look. Did you eat part of the core? Hey, yeah. Grandma just bought him back. He's so cute. Yeah, and then Grayson? Hi. 
Heart, that's right. <laughs> I was trying to take a nap, but they got back too soon. Sophie's in her nap. So I did not get much of a nap in, but that's okay. <sighs> so I've discovered that I cannot sit, like, sitting. My back just starts to hurt so bad, but if I'm up, my back doesn't hurt as bad. So I guess I can sit in this chair, this, like, this like chair I can get comfortable in, but otherwise I just would rather stand up and walk around. Mm. <laughs> That's his helicopter noise. His dead? On my leg? Yeah, I totally can do it on my leg. <laughs> I just am overwhelmed by how handsome he is. Whoa! Who's on my leg? Is that a helicopter? This leg? What are you, oh, what's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? Ah! Oh no, there it goes. <laughs> Your helicopter sounds kind of like a motorcycle. Just saying. No judgment here. <laughs> there it is on mommy's belly landing pad. There it is. Whoa! <laughs> It's you this flying up high. <laughs> Seriously. Why you guys? Why the cuteness? Oh, I it down. It's down now, that's right. I <laughs> Oh the cuteness. It's what gets me through the days. Do you guys like my laundry pile? So awesome. <laughs> So, someone adorable has stinky pants. Daddy's almost home. I'm going to be like, welcome home, Kyle. Someone pooped. Really? This is why my birth ball, my like little laboring ball keeps losing air. Because you kids keep playing with it. He's like, yep. Kyle unpacked all of our stuff to make our belly casting kit thing. Kitchen punch. Me too! Me too! <laughs> smell, Mom! Smell! <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, wow, that actually yeah. smells amazing. Yeah. I want to smell that purple one. Purple yeah. one, huh? Okay. I want to get that apple cider one on the way out, too. Some lilac pepper. That was amazing. Ooh, lilac. Me too! <laughs> It's too much, no, Kyle. No, They're too, it's too much. It's too cute. Oh. So what, Mommy, it's not all that of one it. smells not. <laughs> but that apple cider one was amazing. Well, this one's apple. apple. <laughs> so we're at Kohl's again. Um, we, the other Kohl's was out of the sizes of the sheets I like. So we came to this one. I actually feel really good, except that the... <laughs> the undercarriage of my belly. I think I need one of those like belly girdle lift things because it's just like ouch every step. I'm like ouch, ouch, ouch. <laughs> but otherwise, I feel awesome. Uh, that is interesting. Look at that. Let's smell it. Sunday morning. It's too, it's too much. It's too like. Mapley? I guess if you like that kind of thing, you'd like it. But this to me is too much. <laughs> That's fun. All right, we just got back from our shopping escapades. So the kids are eating a late dinner, and we're watching a little Wiggles. Oh, I didn't hit play. I told Kyle that I was gonna use the Wiggle songs to like induce labor and get the baby out. <laughs> hey, it don't work. I just do these dances. I don't knock it till I try it. Anyway, um, so we went back to calls. And 
this is, so I don't know if I've shared the saga of my like broken vacuum cleaner with you guys or not. Anyway, my I have a Dyson, but it, I've had it for like six, six, seven years. I don't remember. I've had it for a long time. Well, it's like over the last couple months, it's not been picking up as well. So I like cleaned it and I was like, Ooh. anyway, just been losing its suction and it's not supposed to ever lose its suction, so they'll fix it. But it's the old version, so it's the version where if you want to use the hose, you take the hose out and then you have to like, if you want to keep the hose out while you're vacuuming, which I do, like I vacuum and, and use the hose along the edges, you have to like, well I guess if you were short you wouldn't have to do this, but if you're any kind of height you have to like bend over to keep vacuuming and have the hose out at the same time. It's really annoying. <laughs> so they fixed it on like the newer models. So anyway, we just decided... And I complain about it all the time to come, like, it hurts my back, I hate the back of my So we just decided to get a new one. So that's what we were getting to. We got this one, the, uh, what, what one did we get? The, there we go. We got this one. I thought I would, I, <laughs> I thought it was, when they called it animal, I thought it was just, most of the time when vacuums are called animal, it's because they're like designed to pick up animal hairs. Well, our dog doesn't shed, so I was like, oh, I guess I don't need that one. And then I found out that in the Dyson world, their animals are just like, they're, they're like, like, you know, stronger suction ones that are good for animal hair, but they're also good even if you don't have any blah, blah, long, long story short. We got this one. So I'm excited. It's lighter weight than my old one. And the, like, when you take the hose off, I don't have to bend over. I don't have to bend over to vacuum, which is nice. It's also nice too because <laughs> it's been horrible. Like every time I vacuum, it's like nothing picked up. My parents let us, what's he dancing? My parents let me borrow their old vacuum, which worked really awesome on the carpets, but it didn't work very well on the tile. The Dysons work way better on tile than any other vacuums I've ever used. So anyway, thank you mom and dad for letting me use your vacuum for a while. Oh, and then we found sheets. They weren't the sheets I wanted. They still didn't have the size, but we found some other sheets that were really pretty and we got them for a really good deal. So here's our comforter. It's not obviously spread out. And then look at the sheets. They're like a slightly off white white with the little silver things. <laughs> look how pretty they look with this. It's so pretty. <laughs> so I'm excited to get off our dark ones. We need to get more sheets though. I like to have, you know, you need several like we have like two brown sets of sheets and one tan set of sheet that matched our old bedding. So we need to get at least one, if not two more sets of sheets, but at least we got one to start with so we can get get it going. Cause that's the only thing we love this comforter. We got a pot pottery barn, but it wasn't part of a set. So it's like we had to go find the sheets and stuff on our own. But that's cool. And then pregnancy news, I feel I feel really good. I'm just like the, uh, I don't know how to describe it. Let me go to the mirror. All right, you guys, this part today, right here, this underneath part here, I mean, I can just feel the baby. This part's hurting. Like, it just feels so heavy that it kind of hurts when I walk. So yeah, this part, like right down low. It's kind of hurting when I walk. Every like step I take, Every step I take, I'm like, <laughs> it's weird. Like I said in the store, I think I um, need one of those, like, they make those pregnancy support band things. I, just, I hate to buy one this late in the pregnancy, but it's like, good lord. Okay, so, oh, there's a picture. I didn't realize there's a picture. There it is on its side. <laughs> all right, that's all for now. I'll see you guys tomorrow.